There is a massive controversy over MOS Homes uh, reply to a query by DMK MP Kani Mori over marital rape laws. The union minister has said that the concept of marital laws cannot be applied in India since marriage is treated as a sacrament here. Now, this controversial reply has triggered a massive political debate. This is a problem which has been there uh, for a long time and uh, I think uh, civil society has been fighting against this and uh, we have been, uh, you know, hoping that the government will change its stand and uh, and take a much more serious look at marital rape and uh, amend the laws. I, I don't understand actually how can this uh, hurt the institution of marriage. It cannot. It is actually, I mean, why did we pass anti-dowry laws? The, that that uh, did not hurt marriages. Uh, domestic violence, India does um, hold uh, the family unit as a very valuable esteem thing. But uh, the domestic violence laws haven't uh, hurt um, the family unit as such. So how can some law actually which will protect a woman and um, ensure that her respect and dignity is uh, kept within the system of marriage, how can that hurt the institution of marriage? And why can a, I mean, when it can be applied to the entire world, why is it that, uh, especially now in these days, in the modern times, when we are more insensitive and more uh, understanding of women's rights and issues, why cannot uh, we amend this uh, law and why can't we look at it more progressively? I don't think there's any harm in it. Well, DMK MP Kanimori had raised that issue on which the MOS Home has commented, but the activists are now also demanding a relook into marital rape law. It's a complete anomaly and they don't have any concept for the violence against women at all. When we talk so much about the violence against women, if it is committed in the roads or by any other person, that is a heinous offence. When it is committed within the four walls of the house, they say it is not an offence at all. See, in IPC also it says, consent within the marriage, within 19 years, with or without consent is a rape. And the same time, they say an exception, if the man is committing a rape and the wife is more than 15 years, it's not a rape. So in personal law of Hindu Marriage Act and Special Marriages Act and Christian Marriages Act, you say that uh, within 18 years you can't get married. So civil law says a substantial right for a man is not there. But the penal sanctioning, they've taken it off. So comfortably accepting the violence against women within the family, within the bedroom, within the house, four walls, is clearly accepted by this law. This is what is the central government is now trying to perpetuate. One side, they want to portray they are the people who are saviors of the women who are com uh, victims of violence. And at the same time, by the law, they say, no, it is not so. So this anomaly has to be addressed and they have to be unmasked. Well, listen in, uh, to the Home Minister's uh, reaction also on this burning issue. Marital rape की बात कर रहे हैं और woman ministry का view वही बिल्कुल पुराना एक नजरिया है ऐसा क्यों? Parliament चल रही है पर आपने Parliament में आपने जवाब दिया है पर ये बहुत बड़ी जरूरत रखा गया ना लेकिन आगे भी Parliament चल रही है